Hi everybody, my name is Sandra Hagslin. Um, I just wanted to do this update because I've been very busy with things, so I couldn't be doing any updates, you know, but this update um is going to be on the Spirit Halloween Superstore, and as you may know, Spirit Halloween is a very big superstore, which carries a lot of Halloween costumes, a lot of, um, you know, really awesome things, such as the masks, the, the costumes, the accessories, the wigs, the makeup, and like animated props and decorations and and even more of the stuff, you know. But I just wanted to update you guys because you wanted to see this update. So um so we went to uh Spirit Halloween, um it was open and um I didn't visit it for a while, so I thought I could visit it again, see if it's open. And yes, um the nice news is, is that the store was actually open and for business, and I really enjoyed the store, but they weren't fully set up just yet. They still had things to go, things to unpack, things to put out on the shelves, but um, as you could tell, um, the store is actually very um, interesting to look inside to, but it's actually a very store, and it's actually a very nice store, and it's very interesting, really fantastic to look at the stuff over there, but... Um, uh, just want to tell you guys that Spirit Halloween, uh, they were very nice. They let me videotape inside their place. I'm going to go back there once I've set up again. And maybe I'll probably record that uh, teddy bear who stabs himself over and over again. Maybe the Wiki Witch of the West, the life-size one from the Wizard of Oz. But uh, just wanted to uh, update you guys on a few things. First of all, you know, Spirit Halloween were very kind, and they were very nice and friendly to me. They let me, like, advertise their stuff. They let me, like, you know, they kind of let me advertise, they, they kind of they let me advertise some of their stuff. They let me in the store, they, they kind of, they kind of let me advertise, they let me into their, they kind of, they, they kind of let me into their store and they let me video they kind of let me into their store and they they kind they kind of let me into their store to videotape and they let me videotape and advertise their halloween stuff but um as i was saying before um spirit halloween is a very cool place um unfortunately they don't have the rising ghost girl yet or the popping goblin um i'll have to come back uh pretty soon once they get their stuff in um I did show you guys, I did show you guys exactly, um, what they had. They had a huge selection of costumes, and I believe that they will probably, uh, they told me they will stock up on more stuff pretty soon as well, but that's not the main point here. The point here is that, um, you know, since they're a Halloween retailer, um, they had some, quite a few huge packages to open up, so, uh, they had, uh, packages for, uh, Freddy Krueger from the new Nightmare on Elm Street remake. They're gonna have him again. I'm so excited to see him. I'll probably go back there and record him for you guys. Uh, because he's made by Jimmy Industries. And they kind of had the Jason Voorhees one at, uh, Kmart. Um, uh, I'm very sorry to tell you this, you guys, but you won't be able to find Jason Voorhees there. That's the only problem I had because... Because that's the only problem I had, because he sells out very quickly, and he's really a really hard to find prop, you know, once he sells out very quickly, so you can't really find him anywhere else, you know. And, uh, just wanted to tell you guys, they also had a package for Ghostface, and he's returning once again from Scream 4, the movie, you know, like, you know, um, he's really an awesome villain, everyone likes Ghostface. Um, his humor, like, with Sydney before he kills her, or, I mean, he kills one of the victims in the movies, it is pretty, it, 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 it is kind of really scary, but the, um, the prop isn't really that scary. Of course he has some blood on, or, I mean, of course he has some blood on the knife, but, you know, that's, that's just how they made the movie, so it can be really bloody, and you can watch it, you know, if you wanted to, so, that's pretty cool, um, uh, they're also gonna have the Midnight Countess as well. Midnight Countess, uh, the Midnight Countess, I was thinking she was sold out before, but when I saw her with, you know, the Rob Zombies, Halloween, Michael Myers, you know, I knew she would not sell out. She's a very extremely, uh, extremely easy to find prop, you know. She's made by Jemmy Industries, and, you know, um, the Rob Zombie animated Michael Myers animatronic, um, the, uh, 
the animated Michael Myers animatronic from the Rob Zombie's Halloween remake was he's an extremely hard to find prop now. He's a really extremely hard to find prop now and you can't find him anywhere. Uh like once once I saw him there now I I think I believe he's discon um um I believe he's discontinued. I'm really sorry to say this, but People won't be able to find him now because he's very sold out, you know, and he's likely to sell out very quickly, you know, because he's really sold out, you know. But, um, I was just kind of looking through their stuff, and, um, <clears throat> guess what I found? I found a lot of their packages, so, uh, they're gonna have the Grave Mourner, um, you know, that's pretty cool. They have her set up, I mean, they don't have her set up, I'll have to record her as well, see what she does, but... I mean, I'll have to record her as well, you know, see what she does. But she's very cool, the Crave Mourner, take you toys prop, you know. And, uh, they also did have, uh, you know, like one of those props which kind of did that kind of stuff, you know. And, uh, I don't think they're gonna have Michael Myers anymore because, I mean, he's a really hard to find prop. They had two versions of him. They had a movie version, Rob Zombie. Uh, his remake kind of, um, it's pretty bloody, but, you know, it, 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 that's how it's supposed to be that way. It's pretty bloody, you know, the, they have, you know, it's made by, it, the, the, the prop was made by Neck and Real Toys, and it kind of sells out very fast, so, if you want your Michael Myers, you had to pick him up better before he sells out very quickly, because, I mean, he will sell out at some point, you know, he will sell out, so don't, like, so don't ask me, will he get the Michael Myers uh, figure or prop? Because I'm not going to get him. Um, what about the original one? Is he still available? No, they're both sold out, you know. Because if they're sold out, like a prop is sold out, they never return to the store, they never come back, and the packages are never set up again. So that's why, you know, you guys have to kind of find out. You have to pick him up before he sells out or another one um, or another uh, person grabs him. And if they do, then like and and if they do then um you know you won't be able to find him because if you want to be able to find him the most you better like see him and you better know that exactly you know he's very scary but he's a really creepy one and you know i believe that you know i believe that i believe that michael myers is very creepy so you know that's that's just how he's supposed to be you know he's not supposed to be someone who doesn't do anything bad and you know, he doesn't do anything bad at all, you know. It, it, it just means that, you know, Michael Myers was, you know, he's a killer. And, uh, basically in the movies, he, uh, <clears throat> he kills, like, he kills, like, a lot of people. And, you know, he doesn't usually do anything bad about it. But, yes, he is, you know, pure evil. And that's exactly how he's supposed to be. Because some people call him the shape and other people just call him, like, I mean, they call him the shape because he's very dangerous, you know. And because he kind of broke out of that prison. Remember that prison scene in that remake when he breaks out and kills the um, policeman? Uh, they had two versions of the movie. One was unrated. Um, it's not even for kids. And the other was theatrical cut where they cut out the scene. Um, you know, the, the scene is really... It's, it's really bloody, so... If you don't want to watch the scene, then don't watch it, because I'm not, I'm not making you watch the scene, because if you don't want to watch it, then, you know, you know, you don't have to, because that's how it is, you know. But yeah, um, I am not kidding Michael Myers, because, first of all, he's really expensive, I don't really know if I have enough money to save up or, like, buy him or anything, I'm not gonna buy him, for sure, I'm not gonna buy him, because he will scare me, I mean, both versions did scare me, like the original one, but the movie version scared me the most because I was kind of shocked. I jumped, you know, once, like I saw that prop, you know, over there. But, you know, it, it, it's kind of because they sell out very quickly, and it doesn't matter because uh, most uh, props which sell out very quickly don't come back, you know. So, I uh, think that the only thing you're supposed to do is you're supposed to... Uh, I mean, I mean, like, they don't kind of have them, you know, they kind of don't have them anymore since they sold out very quickly, but, um, yeah, but, you know, Michael Myers, you'll never find both of them, but, you know, because once they sell out, they're not coming back, so, so, yeah, that's, like, how it is, you know, so, yeah, and, um, yeah, um, 
I uh, hope you enjoy this update, and um, I uh, hope you enjoy this update. And I uh, hope you enjoy this. I uh, and yeah, I uh, hope you enjoy this update. And stay tuned. I'll see you all again soon. Thank you all for watching. Um, uh, just um, if you guys have any questions or comments that I can respond to, please leave them in the comments section down below. Um, I would be very happy to uh, answer your questions as soon as um, you know, I find them. But no, thank you all for, but but yeah, but um, thank you all for watching this uh video. Um, uh, make sure you stay subscribed so you can see like some like some more brand new like Halloween videos that I will be making. I will see you all again soon. Thank you all. Thank you all for watching this video, and um, uh, and uh, take care, everyone. Take care. Thank you all for watching once again.